What is up, dudes? How is the water freezing in your ice maker? <laughs> it's Sea Camp, and uh, we got a big trade coming up, as you can see. If you might have saw it right there, but uh, anyway, we're, I'm gonna tell you it right now. So, uh, David Lee is now with us as our starting power forward. Also, we got a steal right here. Also, we got Darrell Wright, a great young small forward. Who they both came from Golden State. And uh, Darrell Wright's going to be our sixth man coming off the bench. It's pretty hard to put him in a, another spot because we got Danny Granger. But anyway, you're going to see it right here. We had to give up, though, Paul George, a great player. But it's okay. We also had to give up Mike Dunleavy. And I never use Mike Dunleavy, so who cares? So our first play here, Michael Beasley driving in, acting like a monster. And he just puts it in. And David Lee comes right back, kicking it to Gordon. Why not let it go? And I just put that ball in the hoop. As you can see on the next play, Dan Danny Granger faking left. He drives, gets swatted out of bounds, and that was not what I was hoping for right there. And you get to see Darko just looking like, I just killed you, Danny Granger. So we come back right here, and uh, Jameer Nelson takes the ball, dribbles it outside, kicking it back to Granger. Over back to Nelson. I don't know what he was thinking anyway, but Granger finds some open range. He lets it go. That ball is good. And uh, Roy Hibbert right here, and... Uh, he asks for it and it puts it in right where the, nobody was even guarding him. I don't even know what they were thinking. So uh, right here, Johnny Flynn wants a pump. And uh, right now, Gordon lining up a two. Let's that ball go. Yes, sir. Next play here, they miss an open jumper. Jameer Nelson says, let's run with it. Kicking it to Granger, he decides not to shoot it. I don't know what he's thinking right there. And uh, Roy Hibbert says, uh-oh. But he gets hacked and fouled, and Roy Hibbert hits the first. <coughs> Excuse me, guys, I'm still pretty sick. I'm sorry, but um, Roy Hibbert drills the second, and we're, only, we're up by four right now. And uh, Roy Hibbert kicking it over to David Lee. This is 13 cross. Actually, I'm, excuse me. It's 12. This play is called 12 cross. Gordon lining up a three. Got it. Eric Gordon, the sealer, the dealer. And a beautiful pass right here to Wesley Johnson to tie the game. And uh, dip at 25. And another high scoring game. I will tell you that it's another high scoring affair. And uh, with a nice pick and roll for Roy Hibbert. And he just dunks it home. Dunk nasty. Uh, Martel Webster trying to find Jameer, uh, uh, Johnny Flynn on that play, but he finds Jameer, and this is just amazing. He finds Darrell Wright open for three splash, and uh, what a play right there. Pretty sick, nasty play. This is why it's on Hall of Fame. Josh McRoberts doing all he can, all of his might, but doesn't get the block. And uh, Martel Webster putting it down, and they're only down by one right now. And uh, Martel bringing it up, so that was a pretty nice play. Uh, Jameer... Losing the ball right there, and uh, Johnny Flynn stopping and waiting for a play call right here. Finds Wesley Johnson, who posts up Anthony Randolph, and uh, giving it back to him. Another Hall of Fame play right here for Anthony Randolph, who just turns around. McRoberts can do nothing against that. And uh, time winding down, we're going to run a quick pick and roll with our six man, Darrell Wright. And just great team chemistry already. Finding Roy Hibbert once again on the team. Um, pick and roll right there, and uh, Johnny Flynn just hoping to get it in. Jacks up a deep one. That's no good. We're going in the second quarter here. They're up by three points, and uh, Beasley stops it, giving it back to Johnny Flynn. Anthony Randolph wants it. He doesn't get it, though. Johnny Flynn wide open, top of the key, bang. And they're up by eight, or six, excuse me, six points right now. Darrell Wright gets another screen. These screens are really working right now, but David Lee with a pump fake and score right there. And then we're up by, uh, we're down by three points right now. And uh, Johnny Flynn on the run stops because of some miscommunication right there with Darrell Wright and Jameer picking up the same man. I don't know what Eric Gordon was thinking right there, but Lazar says, this is my time. And he puts his team back up by five. And Danny Granger just working inside, puts it in. We're down by three. Next play, Eric Gordon using that screen, and David Lee powers it home. Welcome to Indiana, David Lee. Uh, right now, James Posey, a good three-point shooter, but he decides to drive and posterize on Anthony Randolph. But um, right now, Jameer Nelson as a play, uh, the out-of-bounds play, finding Danny Granger open for three. Why not let it go? Yes, sir. 
And uh, we're up by five right now, as you can see. And, oh, Roy Hibbert says, out of my house. It's Indiana. Yeah. And Jameer bringing it up. They got some running room. Danny Granger open. Bad release. Still got to fall. And uh, Corver. No good by uh, Wesley Johnson. Here comes Jameer. Finding Eric Gordon on the back cut. He does a little 360 move dunk. Yes, sir. And we're up by nine right now. Luke Ridnauer using that. None, no speed he has, but he's able to kick it out to Wesley, who says, oh, yeah, we're going to win this one. I don't know about that run, but um, Eric Gordon. The play was supposed to be designed to give it to Jay, uh, Roy Hibbert on that one, but I guess he can break some plays for some better ones. And Danny Gerger with the up fake and dunk. So um, we got a seven-point lead right here, and uh, the nasty cutback move from behind, and he just throws it up. But you know what they were thinking? They were thinking, why don't we try it again? Eric Gordon cheats, and they throw it again. Another G moment of the game. There were two G moments right there, but Roy Hibbert gets an and one as he's rolling to the basket. And Roy Hibbert just is a beast. I think he'll be a great player. He's a beast inside in the post anywhere. You put him anywhere, he can shoot that outside jumper. I mean, anything, and he hits that free throw. He's pretty good at free throws. I shoot a lot with him. So uh, time winding down in the second half, and the halftime is now. And uh, Indiana up by 11 at the half, so uh, I'm liking where this is going. So uh, at the half, <coughs> the two, well, we have 25 assists already. That's a amazing. You don't even get that in a game sometimes. Eric Gordon with 20 points. Wesley with 15, as you can see right there. And uh, Roy Hibbert with a few pump fakes. Doesn't work, so he kicks it to Danny Granger, who pumps again. Finding Roy Hibbert on the run, dunks it home. We're up by 13. Right now we're up by 12 right here. And David Lee, open, but you know, he doesn't take threes. What are you thinking? So this is 12 cross once again, one of my favorite plays. Eric Gordon, open, decides to shoot. Not the best part, but Roy Hibbert puts it up in air one Roy Hibbert. That was a beautifully executed play for Roy. Roy Hibbert, who's 7-2. I mean, that's just a beast play. And this is a 13 cross. Finds Jameer Nelson over to Eric Gordon, who's supposed to make that. But, you know, he pumps and shoots and misses, though. Eric Gordon, not off to a good start in the second half. And uh, Jimmy Johnny Flynn on the drive, putting it in. They're only down by 11, but they score. And uh, so Kevin Love able to miss on that one. But Anthony Randolph right there for the putback. And um, they're down by single digits right now, and it's a nine-point game. And Eric Gordon says... Let's score really quickly right here. Finds David Lee, lays it in, and we're only and we're up by 11. Now it's nine, and uh, Darrell Wright open bad release, but still is able to get it to go. And uh, Darrell Wright with that beautiful, beautiful shot right there. Not a good executed release, but I guess it works anyway. And uh, on the drive, kicking it to Beasley, good. And they're only down by six, so um, not doing too good right now. And David Lee finds Darrell Wright cutting who stands right there and gets an and one attempt for Darrell Wright. And uh, this is another great play for Darrell. And, uh, but he misses the free throw, but Danny Granger right there takes it back out. He decides to shoot it, and bang, he hits it. We're up by 10. Uh, make that 13 right now, and uh, finding Eric Gordon open. He pumps. What a beautiful pump fake. Oh, but a stupid pass, but what another great play. Oh, Carver finds Durrell, who hits the three. And uh, we are up by 16 right now, but make that 18 when Durrell right. Eric Gordon finds Durrell right on the quick land with a beautiful pass. And uh, we're up by 18 going into the third. And Danny Granger, our leading scorer with 21 points. He's just been a beast right now. And uh, so they decide to uh, run with it. <laughs> And uh, Luke Rimnauer, not the fastest player on the team, but he's able to find Wesley, and I'd stop him. And once again, David Lee stops him, but, you know, Kevin Love with a stupid move tries to get it out, but he doesn't get it, so it's our ball. And uh, here we go. We decide to run 13 cross once again. One of my favorite plays, finding Brandon Rush in the corner, who drills it. And uh, we're up by uh, 16 right now, and finding Brandon Rush foot on the line once again. He hits it. He's been on a tear, and uh, he's been on fire in that two shots. And uh, another another play right here, Jameer Nelson finding Darrell Wright in the corner. 
Bang! What a great steal, Darrell Wright. I just stole him from Golden State, and it was a beautiful pickup. And uh, so that one worked out. So uh, Jameer Nelson, using, and I don't even have trade override on. I, it just somehow worked. I think Paul George had so much trade value, and uh, I was able to get these guys. But uh, what's he? Darrell Wright has a is a 75 overall. And he got David Lee with an 81 overall. So you know, I just stole them. And Dunleavy, he's got like 67 overall, and Paul George is like a 73. So what a steal. Uh, back to the game right now. Uh, Wesley Johnson able to put it in. They're up by 14. We have our scrubs in, as I call them right now. Um, but we get our good guys back in at some point during the game. And Beasley with a big, big turnaround, Jay. He's able to hit that. And uh, once again, tries it. Not a second time. That game won't work. And we outrun. We run with it. And Corver decides to do a spin move. What was that? Never seen that one before. Darrell Wright on the drive, kicking it to Brandon in the shotgun. It doesn't go, so a few missed shots right there. But Anthony Randolph comes back and hits that. We're, uh, we're up by 10 right here, and uh, as you can see, James Posey trying to get a quick isolation, I think. Kicking it to Corver, who moves up a little bit, trying to get some open three room right there, but he gets stolen. And Wesley Johnson on the drive, puts it in, and we're up by only eight. And we have to put our good guys back in right now. So he finds Danny Granger in the corner, and that's what happens when you put your great players back in the game or when you put your stars. So finally we get a win, and we're one and three, and uh, we're just being awesome. That's a great win for us, but Minnesota's not too good. So, uh, you know, you were hoping who's the player of the game? It was Jameer. Well, you'll see it, but it's Jameer Nelson. I kind of gave it away right there. Jameer Nelson, the player of the game, with 19 assists. No points, but at 19 assists. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, signing off is C-Camp. And you'll see my vids probably Thursday or Friday or something. So, uh, have fun. <laughs>